Good morning and welcome to Storytime. Today's story is about Elmer, my very favorite elephant by David McKee. There was once a herd of elephants. Elephants young, elephants old, elephants tall and short, fat and thin. All were different, but all were happy and almost all of them were the same color. All except Elmer. Elmer was not an elephant color. He was patchwork. Elmer was yellow and orange and red and pink and purple and blue and green and black and white. All of those colors. It was Elmer who kept the other elephants happy. Their games and jokes were always his idea. If, he was, if an elephant was laughing, the cause was usually Elmer. But unfortunately, Elmer wasn't happy himself. Who ever heard of a patchwork elephant? He thought, no wonder they laugh at me. And one morning, just as the others were waking up, Elmer slipped away. And he walked through the jungle and Elmer met other animals. Good morning, Elmer, they said. After a long walk, Elmer found what he was looking for, a large bush covered with elephant colored berries. Elmer caught hold of the bush and shook it until the berries fell to the ground. Then Elmer lay down and he rolled over in the berries this way and that way and he picked up bunches of berries and rubbed himself all over until he was covered with berry juice. When he was finished, there wasn't a sign of any yellow or orange or red or pink or purple or blue and green or black and white. Elephant looks like all the other elephants. On his way back through the jungle, Elmer passed the other animals. Good morning, elephant, they said. When Elmer rejoined the herd, none of the other elephants noticed him. Not one. As he stood there, Elmer felt something was wrong. B but what? And he looked around. Same old jungle. Same old blue sky. Same old rain cloud. And the same old elephants. The other elephants were standing absolutely still, silent and serious. Elmer had never seen them so serious before. It made him want to laugh, and finally he could bear it no longer, and he lifted his trunk, and at the top of his voice, he shouted. The other elephants jumped in surprise. Elmer was helpless with laughter. Then the others began to laugh. Oh, it's too bad Elmer isn't here to share the fun, they said, laughing harder and harder. And then the rain cloud burst. When the rain fell on Elmer, his patchwork started to show again. Oh, Elmer! gasped at one old elephant to Elmer, who was washed back to normal. You've played some good jokes, but this has been the biggest laugh of all. What on world, what in the world would we do without you? We must celebrate this every year, said another, the day of Elmer's best joke. All of us elephants will decorate ourselves in his honor, said a third, and Elmer will decorate himself an elephant color. And one day each year, the elephants color themselves yellow or orange or red or pink or purple or blue or green 
or black or white. And they have a parade. If you happen to see an elephant in Elmer's Day Parade who is an ordinary elephant, color you know that will be Elmer. And that is the story of Elmer.